Okay, so now we're here stuck in traffic. We are stuck <laughs> so in traffic. It's green, but it's, yeah, we're it's green, but it. we're not moving. We're gonna so, see if we can get some some lane markings. So yeah, there they are. In the center lane. So that icon in the middle there, you see with the the lanes, it's grayed right out right now. Yep. Yeah. So we'll wait for that to go white. And that's, does the car has to be at certain speed to for the system to, um, to kick in? No, no, it'll only go up to thirty miles per hour, but okay. it will it now? will need to. Um, try with the arrow over, and uh, it says that it's currently unavailable. Oh, okay. That's because so, we're like not all yeah, we're, hardly we're, moving. Yeah, we're hardly moving. So maybe we can give them a little space. I mean, it's going to be tough because it's like really back yeah. bumper to yeah. bumper traffic. They just had the uh, Miami Boat Show and they are uh, cleaning up all the exhibits and all that. We can see those beautiful it, yeah, jets beautiful. in the meantime. <laughs> It's also a little, sometimes a little tough too, because with the power of the sun and that we have uh, the white concrete here against the white lines, it's something that um, we'll have to we'll have to keep an eye on. Okay. You try, you could try the adaptive, the adaptive cruise control. Okay. will will work. So we'll just arrow that over, and so we're at a stop now. So once we we get up, uh, to any press, speed, you just we just press the the center button to. Yep. So right now it was set it to twenty. If you wanted to increase the this the ideal oh. speed that you would go. Well, we wish that we could. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you're not going. Well, yeah, you're stopped, so you're not going anywhere. <laughs> going and then we'll, we'll shorten the. You can choose here the distance, the distance. between you and so the car like in front really, of you. Like really, really close the, col the closest one, I guess. Yep. So now the system is set. It's set to go up to 20 miles. Yep. So do I have to? Yeah, to engage, but engage. then. Engage. Yep. So it's looking for the car in front. So should I like press it so, again? No, you can let let go of the gas. Oh, now it's breaking on its own. Now it will break on its own, yep. And if we were to stop completely, would the car restart on its own too? It or? will It will um, come to a complete stop. It'll stay at a complete stop for about 10 seconds. And oh, okay. then if there's no movement, then the system will, will shut off. But all you have to do is just tap the gas again, and it will reset itself. So now we have done already a couple of not complete stops because we're like moving really, right. really slowly. So this is what you were referring to, like yep. this kind of traffic. This kind of traffic going anywhere, but we can have a nice conversation. We I still have to pay attention. Yes, you do. And and so in this scenario too, you're still responsible for the steering. Yeah. What we have is in this kind of city environment. What happens is the lane markings, they stop at every intersection. Okay. And so you know we talk about infrastructure. You know that's one of these things is that pilot assist works best on a highway where you have kind of consistent lane markings and, and going back and forth. When you when you lose those lane markings in the intersections, that's where adaptive cruise control really really kind of comes in best. How does that work uh, in like extreme weather, like under snow and ice? So the vehicle is, is smart enough to say in what conditions it, it will be able to operate and, and ones that it won't. Uh, for adaptive cruise control, it's primarily using radar. So radar can be used in almost any weather situation, with the exception of if you have a lot of ice start yeah. to build up on the radar itself. But what we've done to prevent that, we had that in our previous cars, so we moved the radar from the uh, grill area to up here. Okay. So now the radar, in addition to the cameras and everything else, will um, be uh, cleared with the windshield wipers. And so that, that's a very important point, yeah. Unfortunately, Adaptive cruise control isn't gonna. <laughs> yeah. it doesn't control. It doesn't control, yeah. it doesn't control the, control other, the other driver. <laughs> so we tried the system. Uh, it actually works really well. I mean, it takes away a lot of the frustration, almost, right? Right. Like, yeah. A lot of that stop and start. That's yeah. often what people say is the most frustrating part of of this type of bumper to bumper traffic. And 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 still, I mean, even if I wasn't paying that much attention, the car will stop on its own, and I guess it will give me a, a an audio like an alarm or alert. Something. Yeah, it's, so I mean, there's two aspects. When you're on the adaptive cruise control, the the car will will gently kind of come to a stop. If you're in kind of a regular environment, let's say a pedestrian was to walk yeah. through and you did nothing. Uh, then you would get the warning on the dash saying that something needs your attention. And if you still did nothing, then the car would come to uh, a very abrupt stop. Yeah. So the XC90 was the first uh, vehicle in this, this new era for Volvo, as we yes. can say. But I understand you're going to be really busy for the next three, four years. Very, right? very busy. I mean, by by 2019, this will be the oldest vehicle. 2019? Yes. Um, wow. We're doing uh, the S90 sedan, which we had just released, which is our, our large sedan. 
We have the V90 wagon, which will be coming very soon. And then from there, we are completely redesigning and redeveloping all of our cars. And they're all gonna be in this frame as far as, as design expression, but also in technology. So we're very excited about it. Well, and I, I'm sure all your fans here in the US and around the world actually are really excited too, because uh, for a while, uh, there, there, there weren't that many good news for Volvo. Now there's only, only good news. Only good out. news so far, and that's the way that that's the way we want to keep it. Excellent. Well, thank you very much for your time. Thank we're gonna, you. I'm not gonna say enjoy the traffic, but we're gonna. <laughs> we're gonna enjoy the traffic. <laughs> 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 With adaptive cruise control. Exactly. We will. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you.